Where does the government get their money? Well, they get it from taxpayers. Where do insurance companies get their money? From us. From us. Same thing. We should be able to choose what we want. But, you, but nobody would force you to do, do you collect money? Do you get Medicare right now? Are you covered with Medicare? Are you, are you generally happy with it? You're happy with your Medicare. You wouldn't want the government to take that away. No. But so is it doing an okay job running Medicare? So I should get something. Right. But but is it doing an okay? Is the government doing an okay job with med Are they doing an okay job with Medicare? It's been okay with us. So so I guess my question is, if they're able to do an okay job with Medicare, why wouldn't? Why wouldn't they be able to do an okay job with an insurance program that would cover right, younger this people? This bill they're talking about has no guarantee they're taking over our lives from birth till death. Only if you choose yes. to opt into it. No. So, let me ask you no, something. We will. I'm we'll sorry. have to. Let me, okay, let me ask you another question. Now it's okay. They might, they might do it. But eventually, the Obama told us. He says, I'm a single payer. But in the meantime, we have to get the public option. We have to work with the private yeah, You work with what you... That's yeah. politics. What you take what you can like get. That. Let me ask you something. How many, how many insurance companies, health insurance companies, are there in Washington State today? There's three or four. Right. They used to be 50. How do they get rid of them? Because the state legislature, the legislative body, they forced them to pay for yeah. things. So, so let, let me ask you something. So... I have to buy my own health insurance right now because I'm self-employed. Have been for most of my life. I pay more money than somebody who works for a big corporation because I'm an individual. I get less coverage. My deductibles are higher. I get less stuff covered. Now, I'm only 46. But if they lowered the age of Medicare to let me buy in at, let's say, age 50, would there be something wrong with that, letting me buy into Medicare? I've been paying. Hey, I Let's say extending Medicare to get let younger people buy into it. 